What's going on everybody, it's Dr. Scrubbington here, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Paper Mario. So over the last couple days, I've been kind of slacking on this game, and that's just because I've been, uh, I've been busy with school lately and all of that, so, uh, um, but since we actually got out of school a couple hours earlier today, I decided I'm gonna try to use this time to my advantage, and I'm gonna do, I'm gonna record two videos of Super Paper Mario today, and hopefully, hopefully, I'll have them both edited and uploaded before the weekend. I would like that. I would really like that. Also, I said this before on, I think, uh, one of my Black Ops 3 videos or something, but uh, uh, I I've, I've got to get a new microphone or something. Like, not it's not because this one is bad. This one is in no way bad. Like, you can hear this. This microphone is actually pretty good. I guess it kind of depends on what sound cards you have because uh, uh, it sounds... Uh, do, uh, certain sounds... Uh, do sound different on different computers depending on uh, what speakers they have or what sound card they have But at least on this computer to me uh, th This microphone sounds phenomenal. It sounds amazing, and I really love it But the thing is this is a headset microphone and when you're wearing a headset You know I'm sure anybody who's worn a headset before can say this but uh when you're talking and wearing headphones at the same time like a, a gaming headset that like covers your ears um, it kind of muffles your voice, you know, it muffles the sounds from the outside world, including your voice, because, you know, it's blocking off your ears, so, um, it makes it, it makes your voice kind of sound more, uh, internal, I guess. And that's a problem, because it kind of muffles my voice a little bit, unless I set it in, like, just the right position that I can still kind of hear myself talking, which is what I have going on right here. But under most cases, it'll, it'll muffle my voice, and it just, I don't know, um, I see every other YouTuber is able to... Um, you know, uh, work with it. They, they wear headphones and all their face cams and they're talking and they sound just fine. But I don't know what it is for me, but like when I'm wearing headphones, it muffles my voice and it like it complete it makes me it makes me talk like like I don't feel like I'm talking naturally. Like I don't know how to explain this, but it just it feels like my chest muscles are like in a, a different position or something. Like they're like tense and not relaxed like I'm trying to, like, make it so I can kind of hear myself clearer, and it's just, um, I, I don't know, I don't know what it is, I'm sure it's, like, it's, it's only for me, I don't really know anyone else that's ever, like, complained about this sort of thing, um, I don't, I don't really want to be in here right now, but I've never seen anyone else, like, uh, talk about this, and I don't think anyone else has ever had this problem, but I don't, I don't know what it is for me, but it just, it sounds weird, so I, I feel like I gotta save up for, like, uh, a desktop microphone, like one that can uh, sit in front of me, you know, like a, a blue Yeti or something like that, like a, a blue microphone that just kind of sits in front of you, and that way I won't have to wear any headphones. I can probably wear like uh, earbuds or something, like uh, in-ear headphones, but uh, those, uh, they kind of muffle outside sounds, but they definitely don't do it as much as a gaming headset, and they, um, it still kind of sounds like you're talking naturally um, without, you know, uh, any, any, like, headset muffling the sound or anything when you're, uh, using earbuds, so I'm considering on doing that, but, you know, right now, I'm, I'm pretty broke, I don't really have that much money, I've gotta save up, and, um, it takes me a while to, uh, to save up money, you know, I'm just, I'm just a youngster, I don't, I don't, like, make money or anything, like, I, I'm not even, I'm not even 15 yet, I don't have, I don't have any part-time job, I just got into, into high school, you know, like, it's, it's, um, I, and even with a part-time job, you know, it's not like you make hundreds, it's, it's, uh, um, yeah, it's, it might be a little while, so I've gotta learn to, uh, try to compensate with this, um, until then. I just felt like getting that off my chest, but, uh, anyways, right now we're here in Flipside, and, uh, we're playing as Peach now, for some, for some reason, I don't know why she's here. Okay, so if I remember correctly, we're supposed to find the next heart pillar or something like that. And uh, I don't actually remember where this thing could be. I don't remember off the top of my head where this thing is. So, uh, um, let's go try to find it. And, uh, by the time I find it, it might be, like, halfway through the video anyway. I mean, I don't, I don't know how long it's gonna take me to find this thing. Hopefully it's somewhere near, like, so that I don't have to freaking explore or anything like that. But, uh, I'm hoping to get at least, uh, halfway through the second stage of World one on this video. I feel like I can make that happen, hopefully. I don't know. Anyways, uh, we can also switch back to Mario if we go to, 
um, characters right here, and uh, here's the list of characters that we have, and you could just switch between these two guys as of now, um, uh, because obviously Peach doesn't have the uh, the 3D interdimensional technique, so you still have to uh, uh, switch between characters when you want to uh, um, go into 3D. And so I don't think I've actually shown uh, flip side in 3D yet, but this is uh, this is what it looks like, and uh, um, th there is one thing around here. I'm pretty sure that if we go into 3D, there's supposed to be like a, a secret uh, path or something, like kind of like the one in that one desert stage i think that was like the third stage or something of world one and it, it just kind of like extended out from the side i think there's something like that here uh yes there's there's uh, this gate right here and this is actually i think uh where i'm what i'm talking about because if you look over here if you if you may notice there's a little thing that kind of extends out into the into the 3d and that's that's where we're supposed to go so we got to find a way to unlock this gate yes this door is locked there must be a a key to open it somewhere around here so um, not actually sure if we're actually going to be able to get into World 2 because, uh, I, I don't really, I don't really remember this too well, you know, it's, uh, I remember certain things about the story and about the characters and, uh, kind of about how this game all falls down, but, uh, most of it I actually don't because it, it has been, uh, three or four years since I first played this game or at least first, like, thoroughly played through this game as far back as I can remember, so, um, yeah, definitely been a while, and, uh, um, obviously as this game is very big, um, that's one thing I do remember about it, it's, uh, it's a very lengthy game, and there's a lot of, there's a lot of substance to it, I guess you could say, so, yeah, a lot of it I probably won't be able to remember, and it's, it's like, it's like lagging, which isn't good, I don't like it when the, the thing lags. I've also explained about how I gotta get, like, a I've got to get like the a different capture card or something. I've explained that a couple times. Like I, I kind of want to get. I think I even explained that in like one of the parts of the of uh, Super Paper Mario. I can't really remember too well, but I think I've explained that before. How I want to get uh, like an Elgato HD 60 or something like that um, because I'm just using the regular Elgato right now, and that might have something to do with um, the fact that it's kind of lagging. I don't know if it's like the OBS software itself just not being able to process it, or if it's the Elgato, I really don't know. There's not many things online that can help me. Um, I've searched before, but there's honestly nothing. There's there's not too much on the internet to help me out with this one. So so I'm honestly not too sure at this point regarding uh, uh, what should I do with this issue, but I think I just gotta say screw it and uh, buy myself a new capture card like an Elgato HD60. Um, and hopefully that works. If it doesn't, then, uh, I do know of a couple other capture cards that might work. Um, and, uh, hopefully, uh, I can, I can, uh, fix it up this year and make my videos not laggy. Because, uh, yeah, it's, it's not the fact that I'm using, um, like, the freaking crappy-ass editing software to do these videos. It's, that's, that's not what's making it lag. Um, it's, it's not. It's actually the recording itself. Oh, oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Oh, wait, no, I thought there was, like, something, some guy, like, hiding there or something. I don't know. So this thing right here actually says, uh, elevator out of order. Do not use flip side maintenance crew. I think, I think I've said that before. I don't, I don't know if I, I don't know if I've showed that yet, but, uh, that's there. And, uh, I thought, I thought, I thought, like, the, the secret path was actually, like, uh, um, across from that. Like, I thought that was supposed to signify something, but, uh. Turns out it's not, so, uh, um, do we just have to go in all these houses and, uh, uh, oh, mama, did I get some interesting info from a buddy of mine? Oh, what, what interesting info is this about, about Obama and the government? Let's, let's find out. He swore me to secrecy. Is, is this the Illuminati? Is he trying to make us join the Illuminati? Does he want us to join the Brotherhood? But you, like, you can keep quiet, so I'll tell you. Oh, yeah, sure, I, I'm, I'm definitely, uh, someone to be trusted, huh? I'm the hero of the world, obviously, and now I blow your mind. Vsauce, Kevin here. This is Mind Blow. Ready for this? You ready for this? I don't know if you can handle this. This is, this is some top secret stuff right here. This is very sensitive information, but... You can eat mushrooms to restore your HP. Whoa! Holy crap, I did not know that. Whoa! 
Whoa, you got that? Did you hear me? That's some that's some prime info, huh? Keep it under your hat, bro. I don't want anyone else anyone else hearing about that. It's not like it's not like there's uh two people just standing here listening to everything we're saying. Just forget about them. They don't count. Just don't let anyone hear this. I keep accidentally talking to people. Like, I'm just accidentally talking to people. Like, sorry, I, I accidentally talked to you. I, I didn't want to do that. Kind of in a rush here. I'm, I'm the freaking hero of the universe. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go save all the dimensions. So, hey, you know what catch cards are, don't ya? They're so super popular right now. Kid, uh, I, I'm gonna lay something down on you right here, okay? Um, just listen up. Th those Pokemon, Pokemon cards that you have, uh, first of all, they're not real, so stop pretending that they're real, and stop having weird fantasies about them, and, um, they're, they're just, they're actually not gonna make you that cool in school. Um, if you, if you wanna, if you wanna live a life, you gotta go to college, okay? You can't be sitting in your house playing with those Pokemon cards all day, okay? Just, they, they make you look like a freaking faggot, they make you look like a loser, okay? Just... Just give him up now while you can. It's it's not too late. You haven't heard of him? Um, uh, wh where, where are you getting this from? I, I have, like, seven of them. 1v1 me, kid. I challenge you to uh, a freaking Pokemon battle. The battle of the centuries. Come fight me. Boy, get with the program. Uh. By the way, I heard there was a catch card shop near. Uh, do, do you know where it is? Uh, no. No, kid, stop right now. Just, you're wasting all of your parents' money on this. Do you realize what you're doing? God, the kids of this generation are so weird. Oh, oh, it's, it's making me sick. Okay, here, here's old Islamic woman. L let's talk to old Iranian woman. Is that, is that how you say, uh, belonging to Iran? I think. Have you met my Walter? The old dear. His eyesight is going, I'm afraid. Uh, he, he can't make faces out and he tends to tell a fair bit when he's hungry. I have to admit, though, when he gets hopping mad, he's mighty hunky. Whoa there, whoa, okay. Um, personal information, that's a little too much of it, I think. Oh, is this Walter right here? Uh, hello, Walter, how, how you doing? Let me, let me just talk to you. Oh, hello, sweet Gladys. Is the food ready yet? What? You're not Gladys? Are you great? Grandma. Okay, so that guy's tripping balls on a on on an Alzheimer's. He's tripping on Alzheimer's. Let's just leave him to do his own thing. You know, he's he's a he's an old guy. Oh my god! Oh my god! Please tell me you've tried one of Saffron's delectable desserts. They're they're so amazing. I'm serious. They are so delectable. Oh my god! So delectable. If you haven't tried them, you're insane. Oh, oh, you you are. Oh, oh my god, I, I have no time for you. Okay, so um, I, I'm honestly clueless. I'm honestly clueless about what to do here. So let's let's just go through this door and uh, is this, is this anything? Oh, oh here we got freaking uh, Picasso. Picasso. Wow, look at you. It's it's freaking Salvador Dali. How are you doing? Oh, uh -huh. does this look like you are sporting? Is this what the kids call in? No, that is for ma! I shall incorporate this into my next brilliant creation. Uh -huh. is it, I don't know how you say that. I'm not, I'm not French. The trend, the elements, I must add them more and more. For that is what top creators do. Okay, um, Salvador Dali was Spanish, wasn't he? I, I, I don't think he was French. I think he was Spanish. Um, honestly though, uh, Spanish and French accents are kind of similar like spanish accents not like mexican accents like actual european spanish accents i'm talking about i think i don't, I don't really know accents too well i um, sorry if i offended anybody you know just just gotta say that just in case i mean i mean you never know what kind of people are are here on the internet. Papa gets influenced by new stuff very easily. I don't know why I have a different accent. I was just, I was just born in a different country. Oh, wait, never mind. She's, she's got a French accent. I don't know how to do a little girl French accent. So, I heard this one guy tell I'm that he he lacks vision. I think that might be it. I, I don't really know. So, so what is wrong with that? Huh? 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 See, I, I could do it perfectly. This guy right here is just like, Yes, yes, my child, that, that, that is how you do the accent. I've been training you well to do the accent that you were not born with. Okay, yeah, at this rate, I don't know if I'm getting to World 2 on this video, because I just keep accidentally talking to people. Accidentally 
talking to people. Have you ever just walked up to someone in public and accidentally started talking to them? Like, you know, when you're when you're in a rush to get to your job and you're just you're just trying to ignore everybody that you see, but all of a sudden, all of a sudden out of nowhere, with just no explanation whatsoever, you just accidentally start talking to someone. Oh yeah, yeah, that, that totally happens every day. Totally, definitely. Okay, so uh, 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 is, is, is this that catch card shop that they were talking about? Okay, so let's see. Maybe maybe this person can give us a hint. Maybe this, uh, um, um, uh, uh, lady can give us a nice hint as to where this next, uh, heart pillar is. So let's go ahead and let's see. <laughs> Welcome to the fortune tellers forums. Welcome to the, the subreddit. Uh, uh, have fun. Good luck on nine gag, you pleb. My name is Mer Lovely. Why do I have this weird ass uh, southern accent? I don't know. It's not even a southern accent. I don't know what the frick my voice is. I use the twinkling of the stars to help people find the path to happiness. Totally not a scam. Or is this actually like a, is this one of those like uh, those Indian scammers? If you pay just a few coin, I will tell you the path you need to follow next. One fortune cost you precisely 20 coin. Would you hear it? Sure, sure. Hashtag not a scam. <laughs> Very well then, my vo my voice changed all of a sudden, so it will be. I will gaze into the future. <laughs> God, this voice is really hurting my uh, my throat. Okay, um, what scams do you have for me today? Ah! Hocus pocus focus, cabra da abra, huda baru. What kind of is is this Japanese? Of I don't know what accent I'm doing, but uh. Okay then. Fake accents for the uh for the win. Uh paka puka pikaboo. Ah, uh, is this this is the weirdest African chant ever. Let me tell you. Listen to that. Listen, listen to that. Like uh Asian African whatever the hell foreign uh music in the background. L listen to that. Oh stars that fill the vast night sky. See the soul who's lost the way. Show me! Jesus Christ, this is, this is like really, this is getting really intense up in here. Are you, are you sure you're okay? Are you sure you uh, remember to take your medications this morning? I see your destined path. I see the second floor of Flipside. You find a locked gate near Merlin's. I, I already found that. I already found that. I think, I think, I think you might be onto something. I think this is a scam. I think this might actually be a scam, guys. Oh, oh, what if it's actually a scam? What do we do? I don't know. Let's, let's uh. Mario flips to find it. I I already did that. This this is a this is a freaking scam. I want my money back. I I mean, whoa, whoa, how did you know? How did you know? How did you know I did that? Whoa. Whoa, that's so that's so magical. You use the key you have now to open it. Then the way opens. He he my fortune telling is done. Did you get it all? Yeah, sure. Uh, he, 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 that's all I can see. That's all I can see. No, wait. Actually, this person keeps switching accents. I, I, I see. If you get lost again, return to me, and I, I see the way. I will await you. No, no scam. No scam. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Thanks. Yep. I, I already did everything you just said. How did you know? How did you know? The only question is, how on earth do I actually get that key? How, how do I get the key? How do I get the key? Wait, hold on a sec. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, you, you ready for this? I'm thinking if we switch to Peach, well, I mean, Peach is obviously a different person. I think, I think if we go there again, and this time with Peach, maybe Peach is a different fortune. I'm guessing it. I'm guessing. Well, time to time to hurt my voice even more. Then time to time to make my voice even more sore. Yeah, yeah. Welcome to the fortune teller fortress. How may I help you? Not not a scam. No no scam. If you pay just a few coin, I will tell you the path you need to follow next. One fortune cost twenty coin. Would you hear it? One eight hundred Microsoft support. I will I will give you the the answers. To, to your movie maker issues. Yeah, very well then. It would be a gaze in the future. Let's freaking go into the future. Ah! Hocus pocus focus. African chant. Oh, stars that fill the vast night sky. See his soul. Lost the way. Show me. Now. You friggin' scrub. I see your path. I, I see. Second floor of flips. Oh, wait. No. Mm, it's, it's, it's the same thing. Even, even though I'm peach. Even though I'm peach. Yep, I got it. I just wasted another 20 coins. Wow. Totally hashtag not a scam. 
Hashtag not a scam. Okay, do we have to talk to every single person in town? I'm getting the impression that we have to go on some uh, some crazy uh, talking spree and just accidentally talk to everybody in town. Oh, hello there. Is, is this your first time in Flipside? We don't get many visitors, so I'm ever so glad I got to meet you. Take care. Oh, okay, so that's absolutely useless. Uh, thanks for being absolutely useless, woman. Okay, who's this guy? Hmm, this town's so peaceful. If you ask me, that's how... Oh, wait, no, I already talked to this guy. Um, yeah, uh... If it started raining girls, wait, what? That already happened. No way. Okay, so, uh, yeah, it started raining girls, like he just said. Okay. Yep. Mm hmm. Uh, uh, yep. Peach is the girl that rained out of the sky. And he here's Squidward. Yes, I, I know that. Wait, that's the guy who says, uh, hilarious. <laughs> okay, seriously. Seriously. I, I don't know wh where this, where is this heart pillar? I feel like, I think there was like a, uh, another pixel that we're supposed to get here or something. Like, there's like a, a pipe or something as well. And I think we're supposed to go through that or something. I, I'm, I'm honestly not sure what we're supposed to do. I might actually have to pull out the, the walkthrough. I might actually have to do that. I don't know. There are houses back there. And uh, if, if we switch back to Mario and go into 3D, you can see... That it's it's physically possible to get back there. You you can see it. Uh, there there's something back there. There's even like an item there or something. I think unless it's just a person. Um, I don't know. Uh, yeah, that's 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 actually just a person. But uh, um, you you could see that there's a, there's something back there. And but there's nothing over here though. But if if you do see, um, there is a crack. There's like a little crack in the wall, um, at the bottom over here to the right and uh that's why i do remember there's uh there's like another pixel and i believe it's like a bomb of some sort or something like a a bomb pixel and we got to use that to break that and then there's like a key on that alleyway of of flip side and uh, that's how we get into the gate and finally unlock the next heart pillar so we're gonna actually have to do some uh uh, searching here the thing is I, I don't know how to get into I don't know how to get that uh that pixel I don't know how to get it so um let's see let's let's just check up here one more time and if I if I can't find anything then I might just have to pull up a walkthrough a uh, good old walkthrough on on Google Chrome so let's flip into 3D maybe maybe there's something in 3D here that I just missed or something because there is uh another alleyway over there as well but I don't think if we can I don't think we can actually get over there. I don't think we can actually go over there. Wait, hold on. There, there's a pipe. Whoa, I just saw that. There, there's a pipe. You can see that, can't you? There's, there's like a, a pipe over there. But the thing is, uh, once again, I, I don't know how to get that. I don't know how to get to that pipe. Um, it's, it's kind of weird because it seems like we need to use, um, like uh, the bomb pixel to get through to the other side of flip side. And then maybe there's a pipe there that leads to up here. Um, actually, no, I, I feel like... Uh, okay, so the way I think this goes is uh, um, we get the bomb pixel, right? Then we bust a hole in the wall and we go to that side. That is where the key is. And we take the key to the gate, open up the gate and go to that alleyway. And then there's a pipe there that leads up here. And I'm not sure if there's actually anything up here. Because it seems from the looks of this, there's like really nothing special up here. Maybe it's just concealed by the blocks. I don't know. But I feel like we have to get the bomb pixel first. Before we can go through the gate. Because I feel like you need the bomb pixel to get the key. But it could, it could easily be the other way around. Like I said, I don't remember that much about this game so looks like i'm just gonna have to do some exploring and uh, hope to find this thing and by the time i do find it i think it should have been enough time to uh um end the episode anyway so let's go ahead and uh, may maybe it's just in merlin's house maybe i'm just like uh maybe maybe merlin knows something that we don't let's see um the key i get i forgot he he he, he gave us the key he f he gave us the key. Well, well, I, I I feel I feel stupid right now. I I feel um pretty retarded right now. I just forgot to actually do this. Yeah, old key. Here we go. Um, okay. Well, there's there's that. There's the answer. Okay, so I just wasted time. Um, but at least we got to uh, accidentally talk 
to the uh, the people of Flipside, and we got to know a little bit about them. So uh, that that's a that's a good thing, right? That's a positive. Yeah, I actually uh, I don't I don't know why, but I just I checked it with uh, with Tippy, but I forgot to actually try going up to it because I thought I didn't have the key. Like I just I had some weird like case of like short term memory loss or something like that. Like not really, but uh. Um, I just, I just forgot that he actually gave us the key. Like, I thought, I thought Merlin went off somewhere, but, uh, no, he's, he's still, he's still chilling in his, in his house. He's still there. And he did, in fact, give us the key. So now we're here. Um, but from here, um, as you can see, there's a pipe. Uh, but, oh yeah, I forgot. Now, now we can, uh, come right here, I believe. And, uh, now there's this secret path right here. And, uh, Flipside Outskirts Ahead, Monster Advisory, well, um... Yeah, screw all you bitches, I'm coming for you, I'm coming for you. So here's the, here are the outskirts of Flipside. I really love this place, though, like, I, I would, I, if, if I were in this, in this dimension, I, I would honestly like living here. Um, aside from the black hole that's gonna kill the world in 2012, you know, uh, cause this is, this is 2007 right here. Other than that, I, I, I kinda like this place, it's, uh, almost like a, um, like a, a Greek city out here, like an ancient Greek or Roman city or something, like, uh, something ancient like that out here. But at the same time, the, uh, like the actual, uh, town over there is more modern, and it's, uh, it's, it's, it seems like a pretty nice place to live, you know, it seems like all the residents are, seems like they're all happy with their lives, you know, I'm pretty sure they like all their jobs, and, uh, um, it's, it seems pretty quiet, too, you know, there's not, like, any cars or anything, and it's, it's pretty small, um, as far as I can tell, so, uh, um, but yeah, no, enough chatter, here is the pipe that I was talking about, and this, this is actually how we get the next pixel, so once again, I didn't really want to spoil anything, but, uh, um, uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get another pixel. So uh, right here is actually a like a diagonal block like that. So uh, that's that's kind of interesting. Just the whole perspective thing. Like this this game is a work of art, honestly. Like I'll, I'll go as far to say that I'll, I'll go as far to say that this is a work of art. Like this game is very very good. It's it's just it's so unique. Like I I could see where people are coming from when they say the gameplay might be a little bit tedious here and there. But honestly, I just, I really like the experience. I, th I think it's, it's, it's a fun game. It's, it's just, it's interesting. Like, it's, it makes you kind of think a little bit. It's, it's really, it's really well put together. Hey, hero, feeling stumped? Try flipping. It's pretty basic. It's pretty basic. Oh, jeebus. It's, it's gotten to the point where the signs, the signs know about the interdimensional technique. What has life come to? What has life come to? So, uh, okay. Do we actually just have to, uh, um, oh, oh, there's, there's uh, another outskirts right here. I forgot about this. Yeah. Yeah, here we go. Here's a little thing over here, and there's, there's some squigs over there. These squigs are, uh, they're, they're extinct in the wild. And these are the only two left in captivity, and they're they're not even the they're not even the same species, so they can't even they can't even reproduce. Might as well might as well end it. Might as well end it. Okay, let's see. Um, that was that was kind of embarrassing, as to how I lost health during that. But oh oh look at this. I don't know if we're actually gonna get the pixel yet because uh, um, I feel like that pipe there is like how you get to it or something. But then again, I think we need the the bomb pixel to actually break those blocks covering the pipes. I don't I don't know. But there is the next heart pillar here. The only question is how how the hell we get up there? Okay, I I don't know how we get up there. Um yeah, not not sure how not sure. Oh, wait. Wait 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 a minute. Wait a minute. Just hold your hold your horses. We got to we got to switch into 3D. And we got to do this, right? And switch back and I don't need to read no sign in it, you know, cause I, cause I know what to do. I know what to do. Behold, physics. Physics. So, yep, we just used the power of logic, completely real logic, to float across with our umbrella. Freaking Mary Poppins mode. Now, here's the heart pillar. We can finally... Put that heart in there. Just, just put that heart in there. This is Surgeon Simulator confirmed. Surgeon Simulator 20. D Surgeon Simulator 2007. Th this is it. This is it, just heart transplant. That's, 
That's that's what I call a heart transplant. But anyways, there's the next heart. The orange heart is in place in the pillar or something like that. And there is the second door. The good old orange door. Orange is my favorite color. That's just that's just a fun fact about me. If you if you couldn't tell by my my Twitter. Seriously, man, if you haven't already, go go follow me on Twitter. Like uh, I, I post a lot of things on Twitter. Like uh. Um, I used to use like a, a little bit of Google Plus just as like a social media. For some reason, though, I've just I've never really considered Twitter. Uh, but it's it's actually way better than I thought it was. I actually I I love Twitter now. I don't I don't know why I haven't used it ever before November 2015. But uh, yeah yeah I do Twitter now. If you couldn't tell by uh, my outros or or the description, except there are two problems. Uh, one. Nobody ever makes it to my outros like I bet nobody is even hearing this ever I bet nobody will ever hear these words that I'm saying like I'm just saying this Talking to nothing or nobody and second nobody reads descriptions anymore I'm pretty sure nobody's read descriptions since like friggin 2008 But anyways guys, I think I'm gonna end this video here for today because I think it's getting uh, kind of long and obviously, I do not want these videos to be too long, so, uh, yeah, today we got to accidentally talk to everyone in Flipside, and we got to know a little bit about this town, and we put the second pure heart into its heart pillar, so now, all that's left to do is to get the bomb pixel that I've been talking about, and I think we gotta do that before we get to World 2, so, um, yeah, on the next part, I'm hoping to quickly uh figure out how to get the bomb pixel and get that and uh maybe maybe look around town a little bit with it because there are a couple pipes that are uh blocked off by uh, unbreakable blocks unless we use the pixel so we're gonna do that and then hopefully hopefully we can get to world two on the next part so that's it for this video guys i hope you enjoyed if you did then go ahead and leave a thumbs up. Let's try to get 15 likes on this video. And also share this video with your friends. And if you haven't already, then don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below if you don't want to miss out on more Super Paper Mario and other Let's Plays and videos like this in the future. I'm off to... Uh, I'm, I'm going to go do the next part now since I said I would do two videos today. So, um, it's probably going to be like at least a day for you guys though. So, I will catch you guys all on another video. Have a good day and I will see you later. Peace, everybody.